Hey everyone, Mark here from Now You Know. If you're an iPhone user like me, I'm sure you've used it to take dozens, if not hundreds of photos. And you may have also used Apple's photo app to do some basic editing, such as cropping, changing the brightness, contrast, maybe adding some filters or text, and of course sharing these photos with family, friends, and of course social media. So when Apple released iOS 15, they introduced something new to the photo app called Live Text. What that means is now that you can open up your photo app, take a look at any photos, and if they have text in it, and it could be text like on a t-shirt, store sign, or anything that you've taken a picture of, and you can extract that text and do several things with it. But before we use this live text feature, we have to make sure that it's turned on in the settings. So from the home screen, select settings, go down to general, now find your way down to language and region. Scroll right down at the bottom and you see the live text, making sure that's on. So now that we've confirmed that live text is turned on, let's take a look at this real world example of live text being put to use. So after opening up the photos, I select this picture of a ceramic tile we're going to use for our backsplash. The app automatically recognizes the text and I'm able to select it. After selecting it, I can do all these different things with it, but I'm going to share this information with my wife so I can just remind her how much we're paying per square foot. So I'll leave you with one more example, and this is a really cool feature too. Not only can it extract text, but it can also detect the language and then translate it. Let's see that work. So again, with my photos open, this time I'll select a picture of this Italian storefront. Now I'll choose a bit of text. I can select it, and I can translate it. The translate function will show you the Italian up in the top section, and in the bottom section, translated to English. Well, I hope you found this video helpful, and if you'd like to see more iPhone tips and tricks, give us a like and subscribe, and we'll keep on delivering. Thanks. Bye for now.